It's 2012, and it just may be the end of the world as we know it. It's 2012, and it's definitely not going to be the end of the world. But when this next biblical prophecy occurs, the second seal of Revelation, when the red horse rides and takes peace from the earth, it will definitely be the end of the world as we know it. Things will change and never be the same again. This will not be another cycle. Nuclear talks were held with Iran in April. New talks are scheduled for May. The world is optimistic that war can be averted. The Bible is not. War with Iran will happen. Iran has been given power to take peace from the earth. When this happens, it will be the end of the world as we know it. Iran is the red horse of Revelation second seal. The first seal of Revelation was opened on 9-11 and the U.S. went out and declared war on terror. The second seal of Revelation is next and Iran will declare war on the West. The time of the end has begun. Mahmoud Ahmadinejad is definitely the rider on the red horse. When Iran takes peace from the earth and causes men to kill each other, he will set in motion a number of biblical prophecies that will be fulfilled, not the least of which is the second chapter of Habakkuk. When this event takes place, the churches, which are all asleep at the present time, will all wake up, all of them. Everybody else will wake up also. This is Richard Perry. And the, I recommend to the church that when they all wake up, there are some books besides the Bible that they should read. However, they must read their Bible. 